Welcome, bienvenue, i dobrodošli. I'm Mirna Jope, and very pleased to have you join me for a tour of my practicum site. I've assembled these pieces as a representation of my competency as an online teacher. I'm currently teaching at a Title I high school, which covers grades 6 through 12. We're located in Sacramento, California. This year I'm teaching English, French, and computer applications. I've really enjoyed my time in the At One program because um, unlike the masters that I did a few years back in educational technology, this program has had a reflective component going through it, which really reminded me of my BITSA program. It's helped me meditate on my educational practices and given me time to think about how to improve them. We're currently on my home page. Uh, if you'd like to learn a little bit more about me, there's a link here at the bottom about my teaching philosophy. Or, if you'd like, we can get straight into my practicum. The unit architecture page, which doesn't want to open right now, there it is, um, is an area where I've incorporated many aspects of the standards, the INACAL standards, to show how they work in the courses that I teach. I'm introducing you here to pieces from current courses and past. I'm also showing that I'm very human and make mistakes, as can be seen here in uh, some captioning issues I had. The links on the sidebar here take you through the standards. The ones with asterisks aren't assessed for the At One program. I did include Precy in Standard F because I did want to add a little something from my master's program, my final product there. The first standard that's assessed, just to show you an example of how I've got it all set up, is Standard C. I include a definition of the standard along with um, excuse me along with the bullet points showing the strengths, the purpose, the challenges that are presented by this standard. The next subpage are the artifacts and this is the evidence that shows how the standards have guided me in planning this instruction, implementing lessons and assessing whether or not my students have mastered these standards. Um, here are the standards for, um, excuse me, the artifacts for Standard C include examples of uh, Moodle, VoiceThread, pardon me, that keeps coming up, a video where I'm waiting for the captioning to show up again, and some files at the bottom. I've also added a page in my site about the teaching certification with that one because I'm really hoping that after some of my colleagues have a chance to go through my site they might decide that this is something that they'd like to pursue as well. Well that's my site in a nutshell and um, I hope that you'll enjoy looking through all the standards and their artifacts and if there's any feedback please find a way to share it with me. I hope you enjoy this and thanks for watching.